Welcome, welcome, welcome. Fun stream today. Big stream today. There is a $50,000 tournament. We are competing in an Omega Strikers tournament. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Omega Strikers Blastoise Invitational. We have 24 of your favorite content creators. So let's take a look at our first matchups going into today. Send the core over to them and then alley-oop it into the opponent's goal and hit that perfect Ooh. angle. The dopamine rush, man, it's so good. Oh. I mean, talk about the dopamine oh, rush, no. just getting an elimination <laughs> on the enemy goalie. One point away from taking this one home. But oh already, God. look at that. What? The ranged shots coming through from Boosley and Katamina. Bob, though, doing good work to try and deflect the core back over towards Hafu. A last second save, oh, and all the way right. down, no! Full Shark deflects it, but not a second. <laughs> it's a dog. Dog. for Dom. I see someone in chat saying that Team Hafu is 20 and zero in goals so far. That's just disgusting. This is one of the longest rounds we've had, Ender. This has been absolutely awesome to see both goalies doing incredible work. Dog, though, trying to push it through. It doesn't happen, but Pool Shark is low. Lupo oh! on the attack, and they take it for the first goal up against Team Hafu. Apparently, one of our players accidentally joined a regular unranked game. Can we play against them again? Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, we're supposed to. Oh, 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 you're cute enough for a normal um, game. So that's just like a little oopsie doopsie poopsie on their part, but that's okay. I feel like they learned their lesson in the previous head to head. They know now that they got to have that goalie always ready. Can't be pulling around the goal trying to make a move, but it still slips past and it's still the bail getting it done. Damn, I like that guy. And damn, I like seeing what we're seeing here today from these two squads. Oh. Of course, flying all over this arena. Dog. Star's gonna try to knock it back. The Dow with the double K. Yo, but where's the core? Somebody get the core, somebody get some more, somebody get the goal, let's go. God, dog's punching, the, he's level seven already. Yes, let's go, yes, let's go. yes, I love the way you punch that ball. Oh my God, three on two now, Amaz dashes on forward, Hafu passes on forward towards the front line, dog versus two, Hafu could deflex it again. It is insane, what a rally back and forth for over 80 seconds now, less than a minute on the clock remaining. It's an elimination, Lily almost guides it on, Hafu deflects oh, it, oh, and she sends it from downtown. Disguised Toast falling back to help him, Tofu barrier deployed, buying him enough time. Oh, okay. yeah. Yeah. Let's go, oh, what's up? Team Lily is the first team to take a game off of Team Hafu. We're about to go into bracket play. The teams that weren't able to find their stride so much, they're going into the Omega Lull bracket. The teams that were finding their stride, they're going into the upper bracket. WTF, two Lilies, codes on Lily, and then oh, Lily's w? also in the server. What's going on here? Too many Lilies, too many Tofus, as we got Scar on the Doom oh. move and getting scored on. Toast and Lily need to make the attack work. But they've been playing the back foot, and again, it right, goes right, right, right on past. Four versions, four versions, ready? <laughs> but the passes keep coming on in. Toast and Lily maintaining the pass. Nice. Let's go. We did it. Wow. On the opposite side, having a big person with some punch does so oh. much work. And you see it right there, Anthony with a double KO. That's what we were setting up. That's what we were talking about. As Team Toronto Eight. is jockeying for their chance to make their way to the finals. Code and Anthony, they force the goal. They force the win. And they're going to find their way to the finals. Let's talk about uh, the next match that we are going to see, which is actually going to be our Omega LOL bracket finals between Team Myth and Team Dr. Lupo. Lupo takes the attack on forward. Myth with a great defense, pumps it all the way back to Pool Shark. Oh, and we have more eliminations going out in the first goal going in. Still a 3-2 lead for the side of Dr. Lupo as they now are finally back to 3v3 here on the map. Still a 4-1 advantage in terms of score. They just need this last goal. They just got this last goal. That's all team, man. That's one. That's one, baby. Team Myth on the defense. Fab looking to find himself the opportunity to kick that core straight through the goal. There it is. They're seeing if they can get that core across the side here, but they can't quite do it. Myth gonna shoot it right back towards them. Bull Shark's gonna heat it up. The core spending a lot of energy bouncing around there in one of those side streets, but Yo! now they score. Now they're on match point yet again. Now ready to re-engage once more. Fab going for the kick. 
Not quite going to find anything here from an angle and a goal just yet. Still a 3v2. Still looking to oh. score it. Still looking to get it. They got it. One more goes past. Myth doing a good job on the guard. Cool Shark sends it right back down the arena, but now we got a 4KO streak for Fab. Myth has been eliminated. They're out. There it is. Good place. <laughs> Easy fit. A 5-0 game into a 3-0 series. They will be your Omega Lull Bracket Lower Run Champions. We're about to get into our final series of the day, which is going to be the winner's bracket finals between Team Toronto and Team Hafu. Oh yeah, I love seeing the micro since we're on Hafu's POV here. That's nice! That's oh, that. Brings the core over towards the right side of the arena. A quick elimination brings it to a three on two. Amaz intercepts the core down to Tuanto, who clears it nicely down towards the oh. south end with the distraction of Amaz. Let's dog send it on home. But those gates are slow to open with the previous fast score. So I'm a little bit surprised we didn't get more PvP than we did as this one opened up. But we are nice. going to see the core dangerous so close. We are going to see the core in there. <laughs> two more, two more, two more. Gotta poke out dog early on, and that's exactly what they did this time around. The glide off, what a shot! Anthony takes it even. Anthony's here now too. Amaz gonna send it across from downtown, but no score just yet. Amaz is so low here, in a lot of trouble. Hafu barely able to keep the core in play. Dog and Amaz, all three of Team Hafu on defense as all the damage comes in. Nice job, Amaz. Nice job. One more. He's gonna try to force everybody back. Anthony's been staggered a little bit now and the core's been knocked back towards Hafu, but it ain't gonna be not close enough. Now it's Code, again, having to defend. A two versus three as Amaz looks no! to score. And he don't have to look long. It's all about the timings of the blinks out of Anthony. Already spending that cooldown and Amaz turns it around. Anthony is able to get the kill on the enemy goalie, but it leaves their own oh, wide open. Oh. No, from beyond the grave. Hafu gets it done. Girls get it done. Dog looks to knock it back in. The angles aren't being played just the way they need them quite yet. It's a Amaz double. Looks to hey. it. No! <laughs> Damn, Amaz. Three nothing final series. That's it. Team Hafu are your Omega Strikers, Blaustoy's Invitational Champion. We couldn't win, but it was still a super fun run regardless. I had a lot of fun. The game's really, it's, it's really good. It's the, today was a lot of fun, so.